Oh, oh, I, for a second I thought you were an Alakai uh, angry eyes. Uh, we could do that. That was, that was possible. I should, like, you know, like, in response, I should just DQ uh, DDM and Al uh, just DQ him and then put you in his place, right? That seems fair. Seems like a fair thing. All right, Splice Helix going with the Nash, probably trying to avoid the, uh, the Guile Mirror. I know he tried to do that last time, but Chris... Rock and the Sakura. Fight. And starts it off with a couple of fireballs. And with a good crouching heavy to Anier, because that Anier is not that bad. Not when the opponent's still in front of you. And then great buffer into DP. Oh wow, I think surely that was another buffer into DP. Me, he just went for it though. But Splice able to jump his way out of the corner, but then jumps himself right back into it. Chris spending that V reversal to kind of get some space and keep up, keep up his offense. And then gets hit by the V trigger too. Trying to jump out of it. Ooh. Oh, probably thought it might have been too far away. Gets a throw. Oh, should have done. Oh, yeah, going for the. Uh... The chip out. Just say, probably should have done a back throw that that would have killed, but no, just invincible DP into super to uh, get that chip kill. Good stuff. Always good to close out that round. And then another great buffer into DP. Splice's jump just a little bit too late, and that's the downfall of uh, Crouching Heavy Punch, is it does not work against uh, deep or cross us. That's why Steelix is pushing Chris into the corner. Just relentless corner pressure, hitting him with all sorts of some sort of drop in there. Just starting off the V-Trigger, but Splice jumps himself into the corner. Then Chris goes for the cross under, but Splice Steelix doesn't fall for it. Oh. Chris is lucky that um, that he got hit by that boom there, otherwise Splice would have gotten a bigger punish. Ooh, into super? Is that enough? That was such a great confirm. That was such a great confirm. And it is enough. <laughs> it is enough. And Chris goes up 1-0. Great recognition there on that juggle. Sakura wins. Great job. Oh, it looks like, um... Looks like Splice doesn't want that, uh... Doesn't want that Nash anymore. Now, Chris, remember, you gotta stick with Sakura until you lose a game. So, uh, no switching for you. Yeah, it's first to three. Oh, what the? Oh. Um, you're right. You're right. I thought I switched that. I could have sworn I switched it. I went into battle settings. You know what it was? I probably hit back. I probably backed out of the menu instead of hitting save changes. I do that a lot. That's, uh, that's so annoying. So annoying. But uh, good catch. Good catch. Yep, Splice going back to that guile. Going back to that guile. Brad True. Round one. Fight. Oh man, Chris beats, beats out Splice's Guile's fireball with a fireball of his own and gets in with that raw heavy Tatsu. Oh, tries the Tatsu over that one, but way too late. That Tatsu startup is so slow. <laughs> Chris looking like he's not actually too sure on how to get in. Oh, great jumping range to beat out that flash kick. 
Ooh, good hit confirm on that crouching uh crouching medium fun or medium kick. And she yeah, but no hit from there. It's going for the tick throw. Gets another throw. What's it gonna be? A third throw. That's enough. And then finishes it off right. Making it look easy. Real reason why Sakura is a top tier right there. That back throw. Ooh. Splice saw that jump in coming from a mile away. Didn't see that EXCP though. Oh, and then a good jump from Splice. Really taking it to Chris here. Ooh, good DP. And we're in here with that. And then a deep, deep. Oh, not quite enough to stun, but a deep down. Ooh, blocks the. He should have gone for another back throw. A deep dive kick. Yeah, that setup worked Sakura out again. Wins. Able to come with good. Close to some, though. Should have done two back throws, though. Should have done two back throws. Easy into easy. I'm pretty sure it still would have killed. I'm like 90% sure it still would have killed. With that, Chris goes up 2-0. Oh, shit. Fight. Ah, oh, we missed that initial jump in, no matter. I'm thinking too much about that, uh, that missed opportunity. Ooh, Chris tries the anti-air, but just gets stuffed. Looks like he might try the jab or something. He's trying to tatsu himself over these uh, fireballs, but it's it's not working. Ooh, gets that jump in though. And a good combo. Tries to throw it. Fly Seelix sniffed it out. Didn't sniff. Once again, getting hit by another EX uh, DP. He jumps his way over that full screen top, uh, fireball. That's just Chris trying to do something. Ooh, this time going straight in the super. Starting that round off right. Been enough time to build it. Then the second part. Ooh, gets another jump in. Chris. Chris on the back ropes. Might get, uh. I don't know. Find his way back out with that V trigger activation, but. Oof. Gets anti aired again. And then dashes his way up. Uh. Dashes his way up into another fireball. How is she better than Akuma? Dude, do you not do you not hear her when she back throws, right? Every time she back throws, she goes, easy! Right? Just shouts out easy. That's that's a top tier, right? A top tier um autoton right there. Top tier autoton. That makes that makes Sakura top one in my eyes. Looks like Sakura's fireball game not quite as good as Guile's though. Is, uh, Chris gets jumped in on, and then gets his own jump jump in stuffed as Lice is working with that corner pressure again. Ooh, good jump in range to beat out the flash kick, but uh, no confirm on that uh on that uh on the landing uh, challenge. <laughs> Flash kicks the double dash. Chris a little bit too eager with that uh, with that EX or invincible DP. That time uh, using getting that minus two mix up. The good old Ken special. But uh, Chris really not having an answer for those um, for those jump ins. As as Splice lands another big combo. Ooh, tries the anti air, but it trades because Light Punch DP sucks as an anti air. Oh, Splice falls for the deep dive kick again. Oh, it beat out that jump and beat out the uh. Beat out the EX flash kick. Big scores. Oh, yeah. English voices. I'll fix scores later. Ooh, 
Burst having a really hard time getting in, but man, when he gets in, he is in there. Especially with that dive kick setup, it's so godlike. I mean, surely, like, Splice will recognize now that he shouldn't do anything. But, ooh, good challenge with that, uh, crushing depth. And great confirm off of that, too. Counter hit confirm. I suppose it just makes sense to always go into light kick and, uh, confirm if you, uh, see that counter hit. Trap goes for it again. This time, this time Splice blocks. He's seen it a little too too many times, and then ooh, Splice just gets jumping and murders Chris with that super combo, tying it up two two. Let's see if Chris wants to uh. Wants to switch back on to a guy of his own. No. Rocking it. Rocking the Sakura. Inching his way forward. Blocking them fireballs. Gets antsy though. Jumps stuffed right out of the air though. Ooh. Good crush counter. And then good space recognition. Get that max punish. Or max combo. I mean. Uh, Splice is going back to that boom one. But Chris is doing a better job at uh, managing it. Can we get some hits in? Rise training the fireball. Man, Gal can just throw out so many more fireballs. Sakura really cannot just keep up. Just can't keep up at all. Ooh, tries to jump over. Boom, gets him though. And then Splice goes for the crouch walk. Oh, the EX Fireballs trade. Oh, tries to meet him in the air, but Splice Helix grabs him. Getting the better of that exchange. And then Invincible Shrew right through that fireball. Splice Helix not expecting that. This, and this round, this round's going down to the wire. Another individual through, but only catches the little bit of it. Oh no, gets hit by that boom. That's a big deal because time's running out. Oh man, is that? Why are you jumping, Chris? Why are you going forward? Oh my God, Chris, why are you going forward? That that scared me so much. You're the one with the life lead. That's probably just bad. That was bad. Uh, Time, timer management from both players there, I think. Chris Optimus just blocks and jumpings now, even anti aired enough. Expecting an EX flash kick, but it's thrown into the corner though. There's a there's a anti air out of splice. Oh, whoa! Whiffed with the uh, flash kick and the whiffed sweep. And uh, splice comes on top of that scramble. Oh, gets him with the shimmy! Dancing with the shimmy. What's it gonna be? Goes for a midi setup. Catches him into stun. And that's gonna do it. Chris blows it out the game 3 2 over uh, Splice Steelix. Sakura wins. Um. You can't believe you had the life lead? You had the life lead even after getting hit by the boom, right? Yeah, DG. Fly Celix going down into losers.